Hey guys, Christine and Richie. If you want more pars, but you got a two-way miss, boom, boom. Then let's make sure you're not hanging back. All right, if you hang back, the ball can go right, the ball can go left. All right, so I'm gonna show you exactly what I mean right now. All right, so real simple. This is a simple fix, all right? If you find that you're missing on two sides of the fairway, check your finish. I'm seeing this quite a bit with my campers. When they get to their finish, you're the target. They fall back, all right? So they get, they swing through and then they fall back like this. All right, so why would that happen? Most likely because you're coming a little bit over the top. Maybe you're not using your lower body. Maybe you're knee diving and you can't use your lower body. So then you try hard to swing through and you can't and you fall backwards. Or maybe you're a baseball player and you're used to hanging back. All right, so when you hang back, it elevates the shoulder. Your torso falls back and off the tee, it can leave the face wide open unless you flip it at the end. All right, so instead, you really gotta get your pressure moving forward. So focus on getting to a strong lead side. All right, so make a couple practice swings and check your finish. All right, a lot of players that fall backwards, when I ask them to get to a full finish, where they get the heel away, all right, end up, heel away is where the heel is away. And that helps you get your belt line way over here say hello to 10, 15 more yards just doing that. But what ends up happening is they're bent with the front leg, so the front leg isn't strong. All right, so you end up falling backwards because you don't have any leverage and support. So when you swing through, you want to physically get up on top of your front leg. and super strong. All right, so get, want to get the best position here so you can see it. Get tall and on top of your front leg. Like this, super strong legs, strong. You don't want to come through with a bent leg. You have no leverage, so the club can't whip. All right, it's really not good for your knee either. Just doing that hurts. All right, so I like to say on the backswing, your trail leg is a stabilizer, and then on the downswing, your lead leg is a stabilizer. By really focusing on a strong lead leg, you'll generate more force and get more pop off the face. All right, so the end result, you're gonna get a lot more pop off the face, a lot more distance, and you're gonna get rid of that two-way miss. If you have any questions about this, leave a comment. I'll be sure to answer in future tips.